I have some beautiful guests with me today. My beautiful little girls. They're only about six months old. Let me show you the first one. Come here, come on. This is Gwendolyn. She's a baby rat girl. She's my little baby rat. She's about six months old. She's beautiful. <laughs> and her sister is this one, Pippi. And they, they're so amazing pets. They're a beautiful husky colour. And they've got a beautiful sort of silvery coat. Um, they're called husky roans. So that's the colour of the coat and the type of the coat because they're like huskies, the coat, and it changes to white. So at the moment it's sort of grey as you can see, but it sort of turns to a beautiful sort of shimmery um, white eventually. <laughs> so these little beautiful girls have brought so much joy to my little life since having them. And I just really want to break the stigma of rats. Um, cause They've got such a bad stigma about them. Like people just, they really, they've got something against rats. I guess it's because they could be um, kind of pests in your house. But I will tell you honestly, they are the best pets. Everything compensates for a dog in my life because I love dogs so much. But if I can't have a dog, I will certainly have a rat because they are just so incredible creatures. They're so intelligent. They're so much fun. They are. They do the most hilarious things. They're just so inquisitive, and they're actually really affectionate. And um, they're just so. They're so much fun, and they're just great. They really are. We grew up with hamsters, but like hamsters, they just don't want to be held. Hamsters, and they're just always trying to get out of your hand. They're always saying that these girls are on the on the move now. They're off. They're off. Hey, Gwen, don't go yet. Come on. And these babies have got Dumbo ears, so the ears are further down the face, so they're absolutely adorable. So yeah, they're just so great, and I just want to introduce you to them. If you're thinking about getting a rat, I would certainly, certainly go for it. Um, they kind of do need a fair amount of space to run around. Their cage needs to be kind of quite big, because they do grow quite big. And they do like to run around the room and do lots of get up to crazy stuff, so certainly get them out and play with them for at least an hour every day and but i mean they're perfect for if you work in the day and then you come home in the night time because then you can um get them out as soon as you get home <laughs> oh where they gone now where they gone baby come here come on yeah they're very they're just so much fun they're just so amazing <laughs> ah she's licking my foot the females tend to be more intelligent so they'll be up and they'll be running around a bit more they'll be a bit more like inquisitive if you make something for them they'll probably try it out they'll sit up on your shoulder and do lots of cool stuff like that uh the males tend to be a bit more slow and a bit more chilled so they will just sit with you and like not really go anywhere here we go there's pippi she's there looking lovely as always you're gonna say bye pippi huh she does the hilarious things this one is mad she will jump off hoovers she will go up onto shelves they really love high things to climb on like we've got a big era really tall area she loves climbing up and down that it's hilarious the things she gets up to she's so funny and her sister's a little bit more shy a little bit more slow come here gwen come on hey gwen ah <laughs> she's just a live wire seriously she's just like all over the place ah come here gwen come on hey gwen okay gwen's had enough apparently she doesn't want to be out right now. She wants to be in bed, but this one doesn't want to be in bed. This one wants to be running around everywhere. Ah! <laughs> Please, no tail in the mouth. I don't want that. Okay, say bye, Pippi. Say bye. You can say bye. You're going to look at the camera. Yeah. Good girl. I know. Let's see it focus on you, Pip. Miller. Look at you. Look how beautiful you are. Yeah, look. I'll just show you. Jesus. Hey, Pippi, look. <laughs> Pippi, don't go my head. Where are you, girl? There she is. Look at you. Can you see yourself? Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. <laughs> so there we are. There's my little girl. One of my little girls. The other one's gone away. So, yeah, we just want to say hi. Say hi, Pippi. Say bye, Pippi. See y'all later.